Hi, Sandra Gerard here, and I'm going to share with you about this Briefton's Quick Pull Food Chopper. This is the large size, as you can see. Um, I've done the small size, the mini chopper previously. Right now we're taking a look at the large size here. So um, this one is a little bit different. Obviously it's larger. Here's your chopper itself that comes with a couple different blades in there that I'll show you. It also comes with this insert. So um, inside the insert it gives you directions for using it as well as washing it and on the back there's an offer for a recipe book which is nice it's an ebook so you can download it and it won't take up more space in your kitchen unless you decide to print it out so this is the large food chopper that we're looking at right now and this is the mini food chopper that I demonstrated before in a video so you can see we're talking about a big difference in capacity we're also talking about a difference in what they can actually do this chopper comes with this blade, which obviously is going to be really sharp, do a great job at chopping your tomatoes and your bell peppers and your onions, but then it also comes with this blade, which is a mixing blade. You could use this to do salad dressing. This would be awesome to have at your campground and do your pancake batter in before you cook your breakfast in the morning. Um, I think that this product, I like any product that works really well that is powerful that does not use electricity because it gives me more options and it's not just having a blackout it's what if you want to go tailgating what if you are camping um, I would like to have this in my RV because even though the electrical system in our RV works really well there's still only so many outlets and there's still only so much counter space and if you read my blog you know that uh, if it comes to salsa or coffee I'm choosing coffee first so the coffee or the hot water heater is going to get the outlet before any food processor is and with this I don't have to make that choice so the way this works is you pull I'm gonna see if I can adjust the camera here and show you you give this a pull and the blade spin back having a little trouble here I'm trying to give you the non-professional videographer's viewpoint. Pull the... Okay, so it's only blending in one direction, not when it goes back. Can you see that? Let's see, it looks like we've got some reflection there. Spinning, not spinning. Spinning, not spinning. Okay, so... um. What I can tell you, I have not used this yet for mixing batters or salad dressings or anything like that. I was speculating. But when it comes to chopping vegetables, this does a great job. Very sharp blades. Please be careful when you're watching this. Uh, links in the information underneath the video. Thanks so much for watching.